New on this Friday night at 5, Pike Township had another e-learning day today because of problems with buses. Last month, you may remember, the school district had to cancel in-person classes two times because of the same issue. Now, previously, Pike Township said they had a driver shortage, planned medical leave, and illness-related absences, but a group of drivers told us it's because of low pay. Our Lauren Kostick found out today they're not alone because teachers are also fighting for better compensation. This was the scene at Thursday night's school board meeting in Pike Township. I have worked hard like my colleagues. We deserve to be paid what we are worth. As a teacher who makes all other professions possible, I shouldn't have to beg for a pay increase to comfortably support my family. Teachers and bus drivers upset, demanding higher compensation, saying it's the reason many are leaving the district. There's a teacher shortage and quality teachers will go where they're paid comparably. The Pike Classroom Teachers Association said a 10 year teacher makes just $1.90 more per hour than a new hire. And teacher salaries are between $10,000 to $15,000 behind other districts. They say Pike's compensation philosophy needs to change. And they're not the only ones frustrated. Last month, a group of bus drivers called off work, resulting in two e learning days. 13 News was contacted by some of those drivers who didn't want to go on camera but shared their concerns. They just don't care about us. They don't care about how we live in. They just want us to come in and do the, our job. And on Thursday night, other drivers said it's been difficult since their pay schedule changed. I have a car payment that's due. I have a cell phone that is due. And my mortgage is 1150 I don't have all that to cover that. And I'm not the only one that is a bus driver that has to deal with that. And bargaining for teachers started on September 15th and will go through November 15th. As for bus drivers, the district just held a hiring event on Thursday to try and recruit more. Now, the school district told us in a statement today they'll continue to focus their priority in investing in teachers. As for the e-learning day, they believe the recent discussions around compensation may have led to call-offs in the transportation department.